for quite some time now, we've known the path that Disney was headed down when it came to their newest woke live action race swap remake, Snow White. When Rachel Zegler started speaking out, when the first images leaked, and of course, after Disney couldn't stop talking about how diverse and inclusive they were by getting a Latina Snow White. People knew this was headed for disaster from the very beginning. And now, with the actor strike delaying the reshoots that they had to do, and with all of the criticism, we finally got confirmation of something that we've pretty much known was going to happen for a while. For the past several months and weeks, we've been hearing that in all likelihood, Disney was going to push back Snow White. They still have filming to do on this and potentially might end up changing a lot of things based on the backlash from so many people. Well, we got our verification today that not only is Snow White being pushed back, it's being delayed over a year to 2025. Disney's live action Snow White release date delayed to 2025. And also, Disney released a brand new look at the film. And I don't know if they thought this was a good thing. I don't know if they thought this would look better for them. But holy shit, this looks like some sort of nightmare. Disney delays Snow White and Aaliyo a year removes Jonathan Major's magazine dreams from calendar. That might be for another video. Disney's Bob Iger and other Hollywood CEOs told the actors earlier this week the deadline to salvage their 2024 theatrical slates is all but upon them. And this is the image that they released. Now, when we got those first images of Snow White and the seven Portland baristas or homeless people or whatever, Disney tried to say those are fake, those are not real. It then got leaked that those are the bandits. I talked about in a couple of videos how I had somebody that said they're not necessarily replacements for the dwarves, but the bandits might end up getting more screen time. The dwarves still exist, but it's in a little bit different way. And this is our confirmation of the dwarves. I don't know if these were real people that they CGI enhance. I don't know if they're full CGI. I don't know what the fuck these people are, but they do look really, really weird. That looks really strange, to be honest. It's already getting memed to hell and back. But there are the seven dwarves for the first time Disney released this first look picture. But let's get to the delay. Get ready for the dominoes to start falling in earnest as studios race to rearrange their 2024 theatrical release calendars amid the ongoing actor's strike. We recently got word that the strike, if it doesn't end in the next week or so, the, the studios are ready to go till January. They're ready to hold off till next year because of how the actors have been behaving and the demands that they're trying to make. The studios have kind of put their foot down and said, hey, if you don't come to the table now and get this done now, we're not talking to you again till next fucking year. With all that being said, it's finally come time to delay some of this shit. Disney on Friday announced it's delaying the release of live action Snow White movie starring Rachel Zegler by a year from March 22nd to March 21st of 2025. The film, officially titled Disney's Snow White, was among the studio's biggest offerings of the year and one of the anchors of its spring slate. Well, they may have thought that's what it was going to be. We all understand this is going to be a nightmare. This is going to be a box office disaster. Who knows what they're going to do in this year? They still had to do reshoots to finish filming the movie, but maybe since it is being delayed a year, who knows what they might do to it? They might be able to do a lot of reshoots and heavily change what the theme and what the entire message, what this movie is all about. I have my doubts about that. I personally don't think that has anything to do with the delay. I think it's kind of all about scheduling, all about the fact that they're full speed ahead on their woke remake. I don't think they're going to change anything. I don't think it's going to cancel. I never thought that. They have too much money invested in this. This is easily going to end up being a $300 million disaster for them. So I really do just think it's based off all the other delays that are happening on the fact that they're probably not going to be able to get everybody together to start filming what they even need to reshoot uh, versus anything else they might intend to do after all of the backlash until the beginning of next year. So it's not surprising to me that it got moved back. Maybe a little surprised it got moved back an entire year. Maybe they just wanted to keep that same spring slate. Either way, the massive delay that so many people have been expecting or wondering if it could happen for Snow White is finally here. It's happening. Rachel Zegler's Snow White has been pushed back a year, all the way to 2025, which you know what that means. Once the actor strike lifts, Rachel Zegler is going to have that much more time to make sure that this movie ends up being a box office bomb for Disney because every time she opens her mouth, it continues to get worse for them. Let me know your thoughts about all this in the comment section below. Smash a like button, subscribe to the channel, ring the bell for notifications, share this video out there, and I'll talk to you later.